Hi, welcome to a new vlog. Today is going to be a little bit different from my usual videos, but I had several people asking me whether I could film what I'm going to be doing to my wardrobe. Um, I have had this like build-in wardrobe situation ever since I moved into this house, and it's just not laid out in the most practical way, and I realized that straight away. And by now, I'm just so fed up with it that I've decided to buy some stuff from Ikea and redo the inside of the wardrobe. So I'm only going to be changing the hanging space and try to make use of the space in a much, much better way. I did all the measurements, so I hope it's all going to fit. And my parents are going to come over in like an hour or so to put everything together. Now we're not gonna put everything together like live on camera with a time lapse. I don't think my dad will like that. So what we're gonna be doing is I'm gonna show you the before and then I'm gonna show you the after before I hang all of my clothes back into the wardrobe and I'm going to be implementing and declutter at the same time because I've been finding quite a few things that either have holes in them or stains or things that I don't like anymore. So I think I'm going to implement a wardrobe declutter at the same time. And this is the inside of my wardrobe. So this would be the before. And can you see how much lost space there just is in this wardrobe? Like, hello, can we like get some things in here? So the idea is that what I have over here to the left is this system where you just hook these brackets like this is attached to the wall and then you hook the brackets in and then you can put like shelving in there and stuff so i'm going to do something like that but then also for rails so it's going to have four rails over on this wall and then shelving and drawers over on that wall and then i'm going to have a different shelving unit to to replace this you could say uh, that will also have doors and a rail so in total i will have more space for hanging clothes because i've got a lot of hanging clothes as you can see this is going to get a right all clear out i still have like storage bins behind these clothes as well so that just shows you how much space is just lost in this wardrobe because this this entire floor space is you know lost because the rail is there but there's like these huge storage bins right behind it so yeah, that's what we're gonna be doing. What am I going to be putting in this wardrobe? Let me show you that. So this is currently what it all looks like. Um, it's just like shelving and all that. So it's the um, this line from Ikea, Boaxel. Um, that's the inside of the wardrobe. And then, let me see if I can find the other name. Oh, this one. The Yonaxel is the separate unit that I've bought that will have drawers and um, a clothing rail in there as well. But the one that's going to be attached to the wall is going to be this one. So my mom and dad are going to come over, we're going to attach everything to the wall, and I'm going to be redoing my wardrobe today. Ooh, do you hear that echo? <laughs> that's because everything is now empty. Look at this. Ta-da! Excuse the floor, it's still dirty, I need to clean it. Um, and then I'm going to be using this little bit of floor space here to put in an extra unit. Plus, I've bought new uh, laundry baskets as well. So, looking forward to that. Let me show you the mountain of clothes. So, got everything lying here that came out of the closet. So, this is what we're going to have to sort through later this afternoon. So, yeah, I will be showing you later. I'm already sweaty from this. <laughs> Uh, it's still pretty hot in he in the Netherlands at the moment, but hey, we're doing this. So uh, I've got this to sort through this afternoon once my parents have left, and uh, I will be showing that in more detail. Right now I just need to clean the floor, give it a bit of a quick clean because we're going to make a mess of it anyways because we need to drill holes. So I'm just going to grab my vacuum cleaner and clean everything really quickly, and then I'm uh, going to just wait until my parents get here, and then I'll show you the after of the wardrobe space. Pray, let's pray it all fits. Okay, so my parents just left and we've built the main part of the wardrobe. There are two things I still need to build and that's all I will be doing today um, because we had to glue part of this together. <laughs> so now the glue has to dry overnight so I can't put any clothes back in yet as I had anticipated. So uh, this will be a two day vlog instead of a one day vlog. Oh well, that's just how it goes. Let me show you what it looks like right now. So this is the current situation that we're dealing with. As you can see, a much better use of space. It's going all the way up. And I've got some shelves now, as well as some drawers in here as well. And what I still want to do is, over here, 
on this side, of course I can't really put anything because this is a door um, that I don't really use, so I am going to be putting a unit right here <laughs> on the floor that is going to give me some more drawer and hanging space. So that's what I'm going to be building right now as well as two laundry baskets. So I'll do that and show you as I'm doing that in a time lapse. That color in my face <laughs> it's really really hot it's still like heat wave moment and I did a like IKEA mishap today I put something together the wrong way and now it actually broke and I'm missing screws to put it together correctly and now that I've put it together the way I want it to I'll show you it's this little unit here I've also discovered that it's actually I don't think high enough because I would want to hang blazers in this thing. So this is a bit of a mishap, so I'll probably have to reorder that thing and reorder the clothing, like the, the rail that needs to go in here because it has to come with screws and there are no screws in the packaging. So that's a bit of a, a, bit of a mishap, but that means the only thing I can't hang for now are blazers, which is okay. I'm going to go and put together my new laundry baskets right now. So here is what it looks like now if you just see it from where you're coming in. So that's the inside of the wardrobe. And then as I mentioned, something went wrong with building the second unit that goes with that and I need a bigger one. So I'm gonna order that and I think I'm just going to or place the whole order anew just to make sure that it all fits. And then we have the two new laundry baskets here which I think are sitting here quite nicely. Uh, and they've got wheels as well. Stay tuned and then we'll uh, Make sure to put this and fill it up with clothes. Good morning, it is now the next day, so it's time to get everything into these shelves. I thought we could do a bit of a montage, but I've got all my clothes in the other room because they're still in the bedroom. And I'm not entirely sure yet how we're gonna do this because I wanna declutter at the same time. So I'm not sure yet <laughs> how I'm going to format this, but I first need to uh, move some other things around that are in the other side of the wardrobe right now just to see if I can try that. So I'm going to do that first and then I'll uh, put you on a time lapse of me going through all my clothes. I think 
that I think is the best thing and then I'll show you the after. Uh, I did manage to, and another update for you, so last night I checked the IKEA website, anything I have to order is in stock and uh, they will be delivering that on Thursday. So on Thursday I'll be able to hang my blazer so I'll keep those in the bedroom for now and then I'll just sort that out on uh, on Thursday. You guys, I was able to fit all of my suitcases and bags up in the wardrobe. I'm so happy. I was keeping these in another space, but they were all over the place, and now everything is in one spot. Yay! So now it's time to go through the rails, and um, then, we're, then we still need to do uh, pants, and we still need to do sweaters. Um, I changed because I was getting really hot, and I had to use the restroom, and that jumpsuit I was wearing was just not working out. So I decided to put on something differently for a minute, and then we're uh, going to continue. Hello, good morning, it is now a couple of days later, it is Thursday to be exact, and my order already came in from Ikea this morning, like, early. Um, so I can start putting that together right now, and then I can show you the finished result. Plus, I want to do a bit more decluttering, so uh, that's what I hope to be able to show you as well. So it's now done, the closet makeover, so let me show you what it looks like now. I'm super chuffed. So apologize if it looks a little dark, it's a very gloomy day today, it's very cloudy, very rainy. So I did have to switch on the light, uh, so I can actually show you what it all looks like. But we've got, this is sort of what it looks like when you 
look at it, you could say. So um, this is the new unit here. So I had the low unit already, and now I've stacked the unit on top of that with another clothing rail for blazers, which, as you can see, works really well. So yeah, I just have my hampers here. Not sure whether I want to keep the laundry baskets in the closet now that I've made everything. So then if we move inside... All right, so this is as bright as it goes, I'm afraid. It's a bit dark, but this is the situation we're, we're working with. So I've got all of my suitcases up top as I'd want it, so that's great. I just have like a sleeping bag and a little mat. Of course, these things I'm not currently using, so this way they are nicely out of the way. And then I put my sweaters. They were already in this wardrobe, but they were on another shelf, and I was always like opening and closing certain parts, so now I just have them all here. Plus, they were also double stacked because the other shelf was just really, really big. And that just was very inconvenient. So that wasn't working re very well. And then over here in these bins, that's where I have my jeans, like pants and shorts and things like that. And then in the hanging space, I have all of my tops along the top rail right here. Uh, and this is why I want to put wheels in this, like, new unit that I just built. So I can easily move it out of the way so I can get into the back of the closet. And all the way in the back, I just put some occasion wear. And down here, we've got skirts, which you can't see, I'm afraid. <laughs> but I've got skirts and then cardigans and then all of my dresses are back here. And then if I move around, we've got the blazer situation over here. And then we have some more storage bins underneath here so i decided to put accessories here again those were in a different space and i wasn't reaching for them because it was just incredibly difficult to get to um, but yeah i think it's nice if i can easily move this thing out of the way if it has wheels so that is the finished look that is my wardrobe makeover all finished and done um it is a little bit darker in there now i think but it could also be because it's just a very gloomy day um, but yeah, so I may want to work on the lighting situation, maybe have my dad move the light from the corner to more in the center of the closet. I think that could work. Uh, that might already make a difference and then uh, we're good to go. So yeah, that is my closet makeover.